Do you as an athlete have trouble with your performance under pressure? This video is part three of our series on how to master your pressure. Still feeling pressure? No worries, I have another technique for you athletes on how to master that pressure. Now let's review the first four steps to make sure you have this down solid and have incorporated it into your pre-game and game routines. You've spent time mentally practicing being in that extreme pressure situation in advance of the big game. You've practiced focusing on the mechanics and keeping your mind occupied and staying in the present moment, right? And during heavy pressure moments, you tell yourself that you can feel this pressure and still hit your mark. Well, today's mental toughness pressure tip is to put your center of attention completely on your target. And that means focusing all of your mental energy on the spot of your outcome. For instance, a baseball pitcher will zone in on the catcher's mitt and ignore all else. A basketball player about to shoot a free throw stares at the sweet spot in the center of the hoop. A golfer concentrates only on the flag and allows the green, the crowds, the sand traps to fade away. The kicker directs his focus on the point between the goalpost that he wants the ball to fly through. Right? A tennis player, the spot she wants the ball to land on. Now here's the important part. You then need to let go of the mechanics and trust yourself to let your natural athletic ability come through to make it happen. Now even if you haven't played well that day, it doesn't matter. Trust and let go of control. The only thing you should control is where your focus is going. I often hear athletes say they have trouble with this concept of trust. I understand, but like all other skills, you have to practice this and the other mental skills before you get to competition. These extra steps, that's what separates the winners from the mediocre players. So how do you practice trust before a big pressure situation? Well, during your next practice or training, you want to come up with a sentence to say or sing out loud while performing your desired action. And what you say doesn't have to have anything to do with your sport either. Sound crazy? Well, this is what it could sound like. A golfer might say, rhythm, timing, and tempo while swinging the club. Right? The soccer player could sing her favorite line from a hip-hop song as she's approaching the ball for a shot right to the, that place in the net. Tennis player could say, cookies are my favorite food in the middle of the serve. Are you getting the idea? You'll discover by doing this practice that you perform beautifully while intentionally letting go of control. Crazy as it sounds, this will actually develop trust. You might also find it useful to use that same song or sentence under pressure during the game as well. In the Mental Toughness Academy, we know how important this kind of focus and concentration is in sports and in school. So we teach multiple ways to develop that focus. With some practice, it becomes easy to zero in on your target under pressure. Go to sportsmentaltoughness.com to get your free video training and guided visualization mp3 on how to perform under pressure. I'm Craig Sigal, the Mental Toughness Trainer.